Chismosa say, it looks like BB Rexa is throwing some major shade at G-Eazy. And let me tell you, the second that I saw the screenshot that she posted on her story, I was like, oh, gagged. Now, this is a screenshot that she posted on her Instagram stories. And you can see it's some type of thread with everybody that she works with in her company, I guess, or her label. And somebody said, following up on the performance looks. Also, any interest in shooting social content with G-Eazy when in New York? Re, me, myself, and I. If you guys don't already know, they have a song together that they made like a million years ago called Me, Myself, and I. You probably heard it a million times in the radio. It was like, ooh, it's just me, myself, and I. Remember that one? And even though the song was a big hit, it looks like BB Rexa is not a fan of G-Eazy. So she added him here. She said, at G-Eazy, you have my number. Why don't you text me and ask me yourself, you stuck up, ungrateful loser. You're lucky people are liking you again because I could go in on all the shitty things you've done and how you treated me after giving you your only real hit. By the way, the answer is no. Hope you good. So oh, guys, I have no idea what exactly went down, but we all know that there's been a lot of rumors of GEZ abusing a lot of substances and not being the best person in the world. You all know that he dated Halsey and he did her dirty five ways to Sunday. But despite all that, it looks like BB Rexa had a crisis of conscience and then she deleted it very shortly after she posted. But if you thought that was the end of the story, no, 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 because she went to Twitter and she posted this. Someone from my team had me take down my Instagram story. I decided to remove it because it felt very negative and toxic. Sometimes trauma can lead us to react that way, and that period of my life was traumatizing. I am writing this because I regret taking it down, and I want to say that I still stand by what I said. Now, normally people post something and then they do an apology, but BB Rex, I was like, no, I'm standing out my shit. I feel this way, and I still felt that way, and I'm going to continue feeling that way, so here you go, guys. Now, I don't know about you guys, but if I was G-Eazy, I would be crying in the corner right now because she buried him. She was like, I gave you your only real hit, <laughs> and ain't that the truth? I think the only other song that he's very popular with was that Halsey song, which obviously he rode her coattail to the top, and then he fell right back down when he did her dirty. But anyways, guys, I'm very curious to know what you guys think about this. Let me know down below in the comments, and don't forget to like and follow for more Gossip Cheese, man, and all things tea.